This is a video about how you can take your Oculus games and move them to another install folder. Um, not to move all of your Oculus games, but maybe you have a few games that you want to run from an SSD drive or some other hard disk that's uh, faster. Um, and the other games you might have on a bigger hard disk because uh, so you, that you have space for a lot of installed games. Um, and this is possible using something called Symbolic Link, and you can do this in Windows 10 by using a tool called Junction, or it might also be possible just using MK Link, which should still be built into uh, Windows 10. But Junction is, as uh, this guide says, um, it was moved um, uh, or retired from Windows 10, which means uh, you have to download it directly from this place. Um, and what it downloads is a, a zip file, a compressed file, which means uh, you have to unpack it. And the files inside you should uh, put into the Windows System 32 folder uh, because it's a folder that's linked everywhere on the computer. Uh, so into the Windows folder and find the one called System 32. And you can uh, put the files here, uh, and then you should have no problem launching. Uh, the junction tool. Uh, but to use it, you also need to use the command prompt, uh, which you open by open the start menu and just press CMD. And it should automatically find this tool, which will open a new window like this, uh, where you can type in the commands. Um, but before we begin typing anything here, we'll uh, have opened a notepad so that we can create. Uh, the command before we use it in the command prompt. Um, so this is how it's done. Uh, we have some place where the game is located and a place where we need to create a folder. Um, so as an example, I will I have my Oculus install folder on drive E. And uh, so E games Oculus is where I moved my games folder and. Uh, Inside the Oculus folder, you will have software, and these are all the different installed types of software. So, uh, my, in my example here, I'll try to move Oculus Quill, one of the Oculus tools. Um, so, I'll use, uh, so, I'll just cut it so that uh, we move the folder, and I want to move it to my SSD drive, which is my Windows drive as well. And we will open this in a new window, open the games folder, and paste it here. So now we have the Oculus Quill folder where we want it to be, but in this folder we now, well, it doesn't have the, the Oculus Quill game anymore, or uh, tool. So uh, this is where Junction comes in, because then, now we can use Junction to create Oculus Quill, the Oculus Quill folder in this folder again, um, without having all the files there. Um, so this is where we want it to be, and um, that means it's this one. So we type junction, and we need the quotation marks, and this is the target folder. So we need to have the the folder that we need to, to have the link from uh, here, or yeah, this is where the link points to, and this is this is where the link uh, is made. Uh, so we open this source again and copy this text by clicking up here. Go back, copy paste this in, and then we need the folder name because it needs to know what to call the folder that it's making the link for. And we need the quotation marks just to be sure. In this case, we don't really need the quotation marks because the quotation marks are in case there's any spaces in these uh, paths. Uh, and this should be the command needed. Uh, you could also rename this folder, it's not a problem. Uh, the link will still link from uh, this folder to this folder. Um, but for simplicity's sake, we'll keep it like this. And we'll take this, copy paste it into the command prompt and click enter 
and now it's created this folder and it links to this folder. So if we open the software folder, we can find Oculus Quill. And we can open it and it still believes it's on drive E, even though these files are not really on drive E. Uh, I think if we take this and click properties, nope, oh, it's very well linked. So it uh, really believes these files are still on drive E, but uh, even though they don't take up any space there. And uh, Oculus will now have the benefit uh, of the speed of an SSD hard disk instead of instead of a regular um, hard disk. Um, if you want to just move all of your games because you are running out of space, uh, you can use this tool instead called Oculus Move or Oculus Backup, Oculus Mover. Um, and you can, if you download it, it's just an install file that you can install. And it uh, it will allow you to just type in a destination for all of your Oculus games, and it will figure out where your Oculus installation folder is. I do think, however, this one is made to move your uh, Oculus installation directory, uh, and your Oculus games directory might not be the same directory as your Oculus installation directory. Um, for me, I have my regular Oculus installation on drive C. Wait, we'll use these folders instead. Um, so yes, drive C, and my Oculus files are here. Whoop. Uh, Oculus there, um, and this is where all the other things are. Uh, for example, Oculus Dash and Oculus Home, and so on. Um, so if you want these files to be moved somewhere else you can also use you can use oculus mover um, i'm not sure if they have updated it so that it can move the games folder as well but but if you want all of it to be moved i think this is about 10 gigabytes so maybe you don't want it where it is right now it can be moved as well i hope this was helpful um i know uh, some of my games that have a long load time i have moved through my drive c uh, right now it's mainly mainly um, this game um, what's it called I don't remember the name right now uh, embarrassing let's see Oculus uh, from other sons yes very good game um and uh, yeah, it loads way faster from the SSD because uh, the SSD is at least 10 times faster than my regular hard disk. Uh, I have the, this 3 terabyte hard disk I usually run it from. Um, so yeah, I hope you found this helpful. Um, bye again.